the next housemate to be evicted from the Big Brother Niger All Stars House is she. Definitely greatness. More of you on our screen? TV? Yeah, definitely. Of course. Uh, don't you guys? Don't I look good on TV, people? I think. I, yeah. So back to back to the TV is definitely. And I'd like to also apologize to all the women around the world. I said something very disgusting. I'm not proud of. And please, I'd like to apologize all over again. Please, I'm so sorry to every single lady out there. Sorry, and God bless all of you. So finally, we got Shay off our sh off our shoulders after all the things that Big Brother did towards this eviction. Welcome, guys, to my channel. If you're not subscribed, remember to click on the subscription button down below to subscribe, like, and comment. I know most of you will be like, I used to come live on Big Brother and talk about and show the show and go live when they're showing the show. But the fact is that I got a copyright strike, so I can't do that again. <laughs> so just hang with us and watch this video with us. So finally, we got to you every day. But before we get to the eviction, what was this thing that Big Brother did with this prince um, leaving the house? It did not sit well with me at all. Because we know Prince was a house guest. Yes, fine, all right. He's an, a house guest, right? And we know he would leave, certainly. Of course, he was supposed, he was meant to leave. But the problem I had is that he was not even standing. If he would have wanted to send Prince out, he should have made him stand amongst the housemates standing he puts lucy up standing so he already told lucy earlier on when they were having a direct section that lucy was gonna leave so we already know she's gonna leave but you sent prince out like prince was a uh, was an interesting person on that show he could have literally sent um kim opera out he could have sent or uh, mashallah but or do i prefer mashallah to kim but if i was to choose i would prefer for kim to leave the show and not prince that did not make sense to me it did not make sense to me that they did that to him it, it, it's like you now told him oh go and pack your things for a few minutes meet him in his section then ask him to say goodbye to the housemate and you eliminated him from the house we already know that they're housemates and they will not stay long but still it didn't make sense and it, it made me scared i was like wow is this a scare tactic is like this is a delay tactic to make she ye not be affected from the show i was literally scared like are they using this thing as a delay tactic not to make she ye be there for the show like holding him back and you know making it waste time because when ek was eliminated they asked um ek to you know they would normally bring the house made to show them their you know everything that went on in the house they also brought lisi in and did the same thing i was like wow these delay taxes that is going on me i'm not understanding they also did for ikea i was like god so is this the way we're going to save shay because we know they've been saving shay look at what they did last week they thought it was going to be a massive dumping and just for us to go there and it was only two people i was expecting like three or four last week because she too was on the bottom so i was literally scared that that was the same thing that they were going to do but i want to tell you guys i was literally happy when this guy's name was called like i thought i was the only one rejoicing because everybody that's in the, the, the in the arena there were shouting like did you hear the shouts like the joy the joy on people's mind that this guy's left the show and i'm gonna say I literally don't want to show that dad during the week because of I I didn't want to see Shay's face. I didn't want to see his face on, on my TV. I didn't want to even see anything about him. I literally only watch the show when they are doing a task. Um they are Thursday um beach party, I'll be this thing party, Saturday party night, um their tax presentation, then today sunday eviction show just waiting for shay's name to be called and i've been waiting for it for how many weeks now for three weeks now shay's name has not been called so i'm literally happy because i was already saying that 
you know, he has already set trap for all the girls to be nominated. And I felt like there's this possibility that he might not stand up next week amongst the nominated housemates. So I was literally scared in my heart that he will still ensure that I already said that if he doesn't go this week, he will stay to the final week. That you will fit your chest. I've said it. I I said it that if this guy didn't leave this week, he was going to remain till the end, like probably top ten or something like that. That's how he was going to stay to top ten. But I was so happy, like the joy in my heart that this guy got eliminated today. I don't like people's ball, but this particular one. It touched me here, like it sweets me. Like I'm happy. I'm literally so happy that he left the house and i would have been more happier if it was kimopra that left the house and not prince because prince acts adds a little bit of substance on the show and not kim she just there talking every time about labor talking every time about this talking they, she did talk too much so i'm literally happy that she is gone and especially when we saw the the numbers like this guy is not like and i'm wondering last week he was uh, about two percent away higher from than tonally badge and who again left last week like i've forgotten who left she, he was in number three but this week three percent only how many people were out five three percent we had ek in 17 percent we had Perry in 22 percent three percent three percent to 17 percent not even three to five three to two three to um ten three to seventeen that's the di the difference is glaring the difference is very evident there the difference is very shown that mm, we don't like this guy she oh my god i'm so so as i feel like something has just been dropped off one weight has been dropped off my shoulder that, that this guy is off this show nobody can understand i literally was not watch, watching the show with all happiness in my heart since she but now ah i'm gonna stand but look, look at the percentage you should know you should know that people have been wanting this guy out since week one huh. They don't define she, don't define she, we don't define she, define she since week one. We can't pass, you know, you know, okay, because there was no elimination. Week two, rich, they don't know me, they don't come out because of that jury thing. Week three, again, rich, they don't come out because of jury thing. Okay, I think it, he was not on the board, so he was in number three, no, number two. Then last week, again, he was in number three. Then they, they, they removed the one and two, the two bottom. Ah, I'm so happy. But the person going home that pained me is EK and Prince because I know EK is a good friend to mess to CC as at now, and also Prince is a good friend to uh Alex. So I don't know. Like somebody said on the comment on, on, on Twitter, like oh my, they just come on, they just made the two pepper them ladies. Uh they made them, I said pepper them, sorry double or halal ladies they make them they made them widows the same night like alex and prince you know do you know their relationship in their friendship in the house prince has a bag any day anytime anywhere ek has been doing that for cc for a while now so <sighs> i literally feel bad i i literally feel bad and i don't know i think that let me see i'm just waiting for Sacha actually to literally shade she because we know she's one person about her, most of us that want she out Sacha doesn't want the person that's been like vying for she leaving the show so i literally can't wait to see let me check on Mm -hmm. I'm trying to look for it.
Tatcha is very funny. Look at what she posted. Look at what she posted. She posted 0.89% we won. <laughs> my god my god like oh my god i'm um you see i i would i would accept this shade because me myself i wanted him to go from the first day but i'm happy that he has gone but i'm not happy for some of the evictions today i don't understand big brother but you know big brother i see big brother at the end of the day now see now he's to get house now he go still choose how he won't run in things even if we don't like how he runs things but at the end of the day now he go run how he won't run out well guys that's all i'm gonna end for today thank you guys for joining us don't forget to like and comment on the video the more you like the more you to recommend this video don't also forget to click on the subscription button down below to subscribe and also you can join our membership guys you can send us super stickers super chat it's very very much appreciated we'll see you guys next time <laughs>